perfect. Cool, so thank you for the intro. So I'd say I've been a leader throughout my entire professional career, and I've never had the job title for it. <laughs> yeah, I might get it one day, though. So, fortunately for me, leadership does not mean you have to be a hierarchy, you have to be senior, or you have to have certain attributes. It's about what you do and how you bring people forward. So, as you said, I've worked in a lot of different industries. I started working off at Google for a couple of years, had a brief stint at UBS Bank, and I'm happily employed at HubSpot. What does that mean? I've worked in a lot of different industries, there have been different dynamics and everything, however, one thing has been the same. That's been me, working on uplifting and empowering women. I did this... <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing this for different things. I've been doing different projects, initiatives, programs, always making sure to see how can we bring women forward next to my core role. There's a lot of different definitions out there to what leadership actually is. The one I like a lot is that leadership is a social influence, bringing people together, others together, to achieve, achieve a goal. Why is this one important to me? It has three things that make it, makes it important to me. Number one, it's the others. Leadership is not about yourself. It's not about you bringing something forward. It's about how you enable others and get others to reach a common goal. This could have been done, for example, at Google. I did this by um, working on a project. Working on a project, bringing together women that are very technical, teaching us non-techie women how to code. At, at uh, UBS, for example, we did different things. In HubSpot, I brought in a workshop to teach us about financial literacy. So it's always different, depending on where you're at. The second thing that's very important is to see the bigger picture. As a leader, you want to see what's the overall goal you want to reach and break this down into bite-sized snippets for people to work on. Again, this can be very different. At the UBS Bank, for example, I worked on bringing in programs to get advocates in, male advocates for the female employees. In a tech background, it's more about getting and strengthening the numbers of tech employees to get more female tech people in there. So it's always different depending on the environment. I want to make sure that it's always adequate for where you are at. The third thing that's really important is feedback. Then why is this important? Leadership is not about ourselves. As I said, it's about others too. We want to make sure that the goal we're reaching is a, goal, is a common goal. What does that mean? I always implement a feedback mechanism, no matter what I'm doing. I have a feedback mechanism to know what, how is the project going at the moment, how are the people liking the project? Because it's not about myself. It's not about the goal I want to reach, but it's about the common goal we want to reach. Okay, so this means I've been leading projects, I've been leading different programs, but does that mean I don't get to get acknowledged because I don't have official title? Of course not. It's very important that even if you're an invisible, a leader without an official title, that you get the reward and acknowledgement that you deserve. Oftentimes, the projects I worked on came from different passion points for me. Passion that resulted into different exercises for other people. Sorry, I'm losing my microphone here. So what I did is make sure to amplify my voice. I amplified my voice by making sure others knew what I was doing and also using, for example, the leaders with official titles, be it the senior leaders or the CEOs, to amplify my voice and tell the story of what I've been doing. I want to make sure that everybody hears what I'm doing and can also be part of it too. So what's really important to me is that if you have others you're working with, if you know you have an overall goal you want to achieve and you have feedback mechanisms in there to make sure that you're continuously tracking the progress, then you can all go out to lead no matter if you have the title or not. Thank you.